Drew, thank you. Now we want to meet today's eight heroes. You can help support life-saving treatment for kids in our community and really around the country with St. Jude's Walk and Run. It is time to sign up because it's coming in up in September. So joining us to tell us more about it, St. Jude patient Macy, her mom Courtney, and Deanna Yonku, who works with St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. Welcome to all three of you. I know this Thank is a very important cause. You're all <laughs> decked out in your St. Jude <laughs> shirts. And Deanna, I have to admit, I didn't realize that St. Jude impacted people in this area. Tell me about that. Yeah, so St. Jude is a research hospital, children's research hospital, and the protocols that they write, the treatments that they write and discover, they then freely share with, with patients and their doctors really around the world. But some of those, you know, there's a lot of rare childhood cancers still that we don't have a treatment for. For instance, Macy had a brain tumor and she went to St. Jude for a specialized treatment. I have a little boy, Gideon, who is a patient at St. Jude too because he had a rare form of childhood melanoma and the doctors here didn't know what to do. And so we were sent to St. Jude, which is in Memphis, Tennessee. Mm -hmm. uh, but there's several local patients right here in the Portland area that benefit indirectly or directly from the work done at St. Jude. Thus your campaign to get people to sign up for the walk and run. Before we learn more about that, I want to ask Macy, uh, she mentioned your brain tumor. You're the picture of health today. How do you feel? Good. <laughs> Courtney, what was her experience like at St. Jude and really your experience as a parent going through just what must have been horrific uh, in terms of what you were dealing with? Uh, it was an amazing experience. We were really pleasantly surprised by the level of care that we had there. It's world class and with Macy's brain tumor there's a lot of side effects involved mm -hmm. and the care is so comprehensive. They look at all those different side effects and they're not only treating the brain tumor but all these different side effects and they're screening for different things that a lot of other patients like Macy have that maybe she doesn't have yet, but she could in the future. So there's a lot of preventative care as well, but it's world-class care that we are so thankful for. We see it at the movies when we go, and Marlo yeah. Thomas talks about um, children treated free of charge. Is that yes. the case for everybody, Deanna? It is. So every St. Jude patient, um, no patient receives a bill for treatment, travel, housing, or food. Okay. And so they cover absolutely every expense to have your child treated so that all a family needs to focus on is their child's living. Incredible, thus mm -hmm. the you know need for this tremendous fundraising right. effort. Yes. What exactly. can you tell us about signing up for the walk? Yeah, so this is our first ever walk in the Portland okay. area, and it's at the Oregon Zoo on September 22nd. It's turning out to be huge. We have a great presenting sponsor with Pacific Lifestyle Homes, uh, but we have so many other sponsors and just the community that's rallied behind it. We've got high school sports teams signing up. We have businesses competing with one another to see who can raise the most funds. But the easiest way to get involved is to go to stjude.org backslash together because together is how we're going to beat childhood cancer. September is Childhood Cancer Awareness Month. This walk is happening in 65 cities across the country and Portland gets to be one of them this year. And we really want to see that Portland community come out and rally behind patients like Macy yep. and Gideon and all of the other local patients that will be there that day to celebrate with us. And we're coming together to end childhood cancer. And the distance is? It's a 5K, a 5K. but it's really not, if you're not athletic. Doable for a family. Yeah, it's a it, fun run. It's a fun yeah. run. It's at the zoo. It's yeah. all within the zoo. You get to go behind the scenes a little bit at the zoo. Well, I said, you know, yeah. wow, what a great venue for this to it be is. at the Oregon Zoo. <laughs> we're so to excited. To visit the animals and benefit a great cause at the same yeah. time. Yeah. Macy, are you going to get out there and do it? Yeah. Are you going <laughs> to walk or run? Both. Okay. <laughs> Maybe a little mix. Good luck, Mom, keeping up with her. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> and best way to register is what, Deanna? Uh, go online to stjude.org backslash together. All right. Well, Macy, glad you're doing well, and thanks to St. Jude's for yes. um, the wonderful treatment that she had. I know you're very grateful as well, Courtney. Yes. Very. Thank thanks you. so much for coming in. Thank you.